some tool what is the use of some tool some tool is nothing but the software update manager it is used to update upgrade migration and add on installation to the system the prerequisite for using some tool host agent to be latest version log in as a user with the root authorization copy the download dead sap host agent dot sa or archive to a slash temp host agent directory extract the sap host agent dot sa or archive using sap car execute the command sap car hyphen xvf slash sap host agent dot sa or run dot slash sap host exec hyphen upgrade by performing these steps we can get the host agent to be latest version next check the version in usr sap host control exe sap host exe hyphen version next space should be available in operating system database at a trans directory third one change sid host name in stack xml file procedure if you want to use the some tool we need to generate the stack xml file from maintenance planner in some we have two versions some 1.0 and 2.0 as part of some upgrade we used to generate the stack xml file and download the software dump and xml file into server level after copying the dump as part of the prerequisite we need to upgrade the host agent and make sure that enough space at os and db level and uncar the sum using sap car command after run car run the sum tool in sum abap folder command to run sum tool is given below if you are using sum 1.0 execute the command start dead bat config host agent sid if sum 2.0 sum start dead bat config host agent sid the faces of the sum tool what are the faces of sum tool sum tool has six faces in the extraction phase it extracts the dump Update the spam and also verify the OS and DB version. Second phase is configuration. In this phase, it identifies what type of configuration. These are three types of configuration: single system, standard system, advanced system. In the single system, longer downtime, no shadow system. In the standard system, shadow system created with medium resources. in the advanced system shadow system created with high resources r3 load r3 trans sql process s gen defined here and also in this phase add on selection trs and spad spaw specified here and any invalid updates and queues monitoring here here shadow system file structure also create that is some abap system folder third phase is check in this phase required space is available for some and for shadow system next fourth phase is pre processing in this phase shadow system will be created and original system data will be copied into shadow system and the shadow system will upgrade with latest patch in this phase it locks the development once shadow system is upgraded with latest patch it is ready to move into downtime phase 
here it asks us to lock users suspend jobs and take db backup and some backup this phase takes long time the fifth phase is execution phase in this phase it converts shadow system to original system and it removes the shadow system the sixth phase is post processing in this phase we need to do the spark adjustment and clean up logs advantages of using some tool over traditional tools traditionally spam is used for applying abap supported packages and jspm is used for applying java support packages now there is no need to use two tools some tool can be used for updating both abap and java patches simultaneously support pack stacks can be applied to both abap and java stacks the sum tool has minimum downtime no need to uncard the share files explicitly tool does the same some can switch the kernel and restart the system but spam saint cannot do this some shows the point of no return with reset option that can withdraw all the changes but spam send doesn't show clear point of return what is the maintenance planner use in some tool for generating stack xml software download where can we view host agent version host agent dot mf file in the path c program files sap host control exe host agent what are the versions of some tool 1.0 and 2.0 what updates we get using some tool patches kernel files igs that is internet graphics service software update manager that is some spam host agent if the system not available in maintenance planner what will you do if system info not update it won't available manually generate the system information and update it in maintenance planner for that we follow the following steps go to spam from the top menu click the utilities generate system info xml Save the XML file to your local computer. Open the maintenance planner. Click to add system. Upload the XML. This is the procedure to update it in the maintenance planner. Have you done some upgrade? Yes, I have done. What some version have you used? Some one point zero. Why do we need to update host agent? some tool background runs with the host agent where to check the logs of some tool some abap log how can you speed up some tool operation r3 trans tp parallel processes can we increase parallel process middle of upgrade yes we can change in some tool update what are the parameters you change using some tool r3 trans r3 load sql process work process where shadow system kernel and profiles are saved some abap system folder what data shadow system contains repository data and cross client customizing data which phase take more time while running some tool pre processing phase which client contains shadow system which user can log in in shadow system triple zero and ddk with password shadow system database schema created by service user services created by sap service said 
what is the path of shadow system architecture sum abap system what is the shadow system schema user sap sr3 shd for oracle uis database sid ss shd for sql server database